Hey guys, today we're going to create a pattern layer in Affinity Photo version 2. Most people refer to Affinity Designer to create patterns and surface design, but you can also do it here in Affinity Photo and there's also a special type of layer that will help us with a pattern. All right, so I will select a new document option and I will make something square. 512 pixels, that will be fine. Let's click create. And here's our brand new document. I will start by designing simple pattern on it using native tools. So if I head all the way down, there's a shape tool. In my case, it's over here because my resolution is not that high. All right. And I can start with simple rectangle. I can fill it with color by clicking on the color here on the right side. So if we go with some dark blue and then using just a move tool, we can stretch this across this canvas. All right, let's draw a next shape. I think I need a star on it. You can press and hold shift to maintain the proportion. Just like that, a color for the star, this time something yellow. I can change five to four arms, just like that. Perfect. Scale is up. And again, if you hold shift, you will have one to one proportion while scaling up and reposition on the center. If you cannot find a center, be sure your snappings are on. This way you can snap to geometry, you can snap to the center just like that. Okay, let's draw something else. Again, I will refer to our shape tool, ellipse. And this time I will place this kind of at the corner. But you must keep in mind, if something is at one corner, I need to repeat that four times because this will be a pattern. So we want this to join together when pattern meets. All right, we got our ovals, our circles around. And now let's give it a finishing touch. I will duplicate this whole star, come and C, come and V, add a bit of rotation and change the color to match that previous one. But I don't want this guy to be at the top, so just drag the second star below the main one. And seems like we are ready now. So what I wanna do is I wanna go to my layer panel, right click on the layer at the top, and this option called Merge Visible. So we'll get a brand new raster layer based on what we can see on the artboard. Take a look, Merge Visible. And there's brand new pixel layer with all of those elements. So that's like JPEG at the top now. I'm going to select this JPEG. So command A, that's select all. I select this JPEG at the top I just made. I will head to layers and I will make a new pattern layer from selection. And what we can see right now at the top, that's called pattern layer. You may see we got different icon in the layer panel. That's pattern now. So if I scale this down with move tool, take a look, my pattern is repeating. Nicely done. I can even move this to the center as I want. We can add rotation to it right now. No problem at all. And as you can see, it's really quick process. We can easily create a pattern using Affinity Photo. Just keep in mind, you must make a nice JPEG. So what I did, I click right on the layer and use Merge Visible option. Then I select that layer, head to Layer Panel, and I select New Pattern Layer from Selection. As you can guess, you can create new pattern layer from pictures, photos, or even some ready-to-use pattern tile. So let's say you got one tile, you can put it here, turn it into a pattern layer and it will keep repeating, keep repeating. We can scale it 
when you scale the pattern layer, it will repeat itself automatically just like that. So I hope this video is helpful. Don't forget to check the whole playlist. I got more than 60 tutorials for Affinity Photo. You can check that next. And if you are my usual viewer, can you let me know in the comment section how's the audio today? I'm using a new setup, brand new microphone. I got some foam on the wall finally. So let me know. Is it better? I hope it is. Thank you for today and I will see you in the next video. Bye.